How's it going, guys? And welcome back to the channel today. So today we're going to continue reacting to <laughs> Naruto. So I feel like a big, big moment is about to happen. Sonade is essentially going to choose what side of fate she's going to be on. What side of history are you going to be on, Sonade? That's what we're about to find out. And, you know, is she going to help Orochimaru and, you know, to try and, you know, help him in exchange for some kind of selfish, you know, to resurrect you know p deceased family members but knowing that he is going to go and destroy in the entire leaf village killing hundreds if not thousands of people or is she going to help jiraiya and naruto go you know help sasuke and kakashi get out of the state that they're in so they can fight against orochimaru i mean uh, it, to me it makes sense which one i mean it, it feels like there's obviously only one choice but we don't really know much about this guy naruto in that last episode man he's doing his damn best to make sure that she checks herself before she wrecks not herself but the leaf village guys we get this video to hit 500 likes i'll go ahead and release the next episode so that it is up to you so if you want to see that make sure you hit that like button down below also if you want to see the full uncut early access versions of these videos my patreon is live and down in the description below where we have access to everything else including haikyuu hunter hunter my hero academia attack on titan everything else if you want to be a part of that the link is down below also i've got a discord as well so you guys want to come and hang out shoot the shit talk about whatever it is and meet other people like-minded in the anime community the link to my twitch uh sorry not my twitch Twitch. although i do have a twitch my discord is down in the description below speaking of twitch i do live stream as well so you guys want to come and hang out and shoot the shit live the link to my twitch is down in the description below all right with that said let's get into it so guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button and let's get into it damn the fact that he managed to bring that out at this moment mad oh jesus that's an uncomfortable landing Something that he took a long ass time to, to master, by the way, or even learn. Rasengan? Is that what it's called? The only ones. Damn. Oh man, she's got no respect. She doesn't even know him. She's not seen what he's done and what he's been capable of, man. Hmm. Why? Yeah, but the thing is, why? Why would he care for her to acknowledge him like that? Like it. Okay, so yeah, but still, man. Like, why are we wasting our time with this bullshit, man? We, we came here for serious reasons. So she's clearly serious then, but still. Yeah, there are like actual. Okay, that's the same time frame, to be fair. Wait, I think I know what she's up to. I think she's going to make Naruto be the thing that makes her decide which way she goes. I think that's the case. I could be completely full of shit, but I think so. I'm sure she's fine and lovely deep down and she's got issues. I understand that. Now, this is what I want to learn about. There was obviously something that went down with her family, right? Damn, everyone in Naruto has just a tragic back pass, man. Hmm? Oh. So you don't really want it then. <laughs> she does intrigue me though. Uh, so it belonged to him maybe? After the previous Hakage, yeah? <laughs> I 
<laughs> Yo, can I get one of those? <laughs> He's like, Ugh. oh, you know when it's raining and dark, this shit's gonna go down. Yo, shut up, man. You're, you're messed up, man. This dude, man. He... That's messed up, man. Jeez. Well, she clearly doesn't know him here. Oh man, that's brutal. Yeah, she connected with him over this. Oh. I swear it's almost like law that if you live in this universe, you have to have people that have died that you want to avenge or you harbor some sort of sadness about. Like, it feels like everyone has that. And it makes every character, you know, a little bit different. And they, they nothing is quite as it seems, you know, like Gara, for example, is a great example of a character that you feel like this guy is just pure evil. Turns out he's horribly traumatized. And I'm not saying that, that you can really compare Sonata to someone like Gara, but it's just an example of how they are all like that. I really, really like that about the show. It adds a layer of like a different dimension to it and you know not to always take things as they seem you know um so we're gonna be really interesting to see what's gonna happen here this side of Sanade that we're seeing I'm really really interested in and I love seeing the history of this show you know the village and everything like that and all the people I love those flashbacks you know it really really like adds a little bit of uh you know something to the show and that I'm really enjoying Well, we know what happened, yeah. Oh, man, don't say that. That's horrid. Oh. I think you're going to, mate. Oh, man. That's a, such a sad last interaction, you know, knowing he didn't want to die and he thought he was going to live. Oh, man. I hate seeing stuff like this. So sad. He's wearing that necklace as well. It's rough. Really rough. Uh, he's so clever, man, that he sussed this shit out, man. Exactly. Oh, 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 yes. Straight up. I respect that. I love the fact that he's so straight talking, man. She doesn't understand because she hasn't seen what's going on. Also, because of the Katsuki as well. You can't consider it, man. Orochimaru, he won't stay, to his, stay true to his word, man. Plus, like, like you said that, it, regardless, even if she brings the people back, he goes and destroys the leaf village. Jiraiya said he will kill yourself if she does anything that goes to harm the village, you know?
Oh, we still don't know, but we learn so much at the same time. So I, I completely, I, I'm, I'm more than fine with that. That was a really tragic pass. That was a really deep episode, really sad one. It just goes to show you how multi-layered like some of these characters are. But I love the fact that Jiraiya had that conversation with her and was very frank and honest with her and just said, you know, this is how it is. And now she's thinking about that and she's got Naruto on the mind. I didn't realize like Naruto resembled to her, but now we kind of know that. So going forward, this is going to be a key part of what's going to happen in helping her decide what to do but i think down in my heart of hearts i don't know her obviously but i think i think she'll come around like i said guys we're gonna hit 500 likes on this video i'll go ahead and release the reaction to the next episode so if you do want to see that make sure you hit that like button and if you want to see the full uncut versions of these videos way before they hit youtube my patreon is live and down in the description below but until next time guys take care of yourselves i'll see you in the next one peace